long to pause before we just start rattling on um, so that the live stream actually goes up live. So hopefully it will be popping up over here so we can see it really soon. Yeah, we have a little lag, so we're trying to work out yeah, some cakes. Yeah, but it looks like we're here. So hello, yeah. everyone. Happy, happy Monday. It definitely feels very warm outside, so I don't care what day it is. No. I'm enjoying it. It's a beautiful day. It's so nice here, guys. Like, as soon as the cold front hit, like, this warm front has just came, and the, it's been here since saturday yeah it's gonna it's, rain later this week but we're not dwelling on that no we're gonna enjoy this beautiful like 65 degree weather definitely so as you guys are tuning in share with us where you're visiting from i'm super excited to have you all here today because we're gonna make some really really fun valentine's day craft projects and not really make we're gonna talk about this i thought this would be a great video to have um, as reference as you guys start thinking about types of things for DIY gifts and things like that for and decor for Valentine's Day. Only 10 days until Valentine's Day. So days. a little over a week. A little over a week for Valentine's Day. We've got to squeeze it in. Um, we'll have some Valentine's Day cards because that's a big deal. But if you want to do a little decor, a few little this and that for the season, we thought this would be a perfect video um, to share some of our favorites. We've had lots of new friends join us. Um, so we're super excited to share a lot of these projects for the first time ever with you. Um, and if you've been around since last year when we launched our whole Valentine's Day collection, why don't you leave us a comment and let us know who's been hanging around with us and been a loyal Makers Gonna Learn fan um, for over a year, which is crazy. So yeah. um, as you guys tune in again, share with us what you've got going on today. If how the weather is in your neck of the woods, we're just super excited. Um, Guys, we are super excited for everything Maker's Gonna Learn. We have planned, we have the summit coming up. So be sure, be sure, be sure, be sure to get your ticket to the summit because that weekend you do not want to miss out on it. It's going to be a lot of fun. Like it's crazy. You're gonna love the summit. And it's yeah. Tanner, it's coming up so fast. Like I know. It's, it's gonna be here. It's definitely gonna be here really quick. So Rachel, who all do we have tuning in with us, hanging out? Tanner, we almost have a hundred viewers already. Yay. And they're all saying where they're visiting from. Hawaii, Kansas, California, Indiana, Dakota, New York. We've got friends from everywhere. Oh my goodness. Well, hello, hello, hello. Happy afternoon. It is 1.30 here on the East Coast. Um, we're just enjoying our day. Man, Rachel, we've been working really hard on all these new videos for everyone. I know, but I'm pumped. I'm, I'm pumped super, to do super, super excited for all of these new videos because you guys are just in store for such a treat with all the videos that Rachel and I are um, making and they're gonna be awesome. So our goal is to be able to post two times a day, once with our live stream and then another with a new video teaching a technique, tip, tricks, hacks, things like that. So that's a super awesome video. I um, whole new video series will be coming out with um, here for the channel. Yeah, and I know that you all love the lives that we give and we do, we make projects. We teach you all how to make awesome projects, but in the videos that Tanner wants to be posting later on during the day, the tutorials, it's just kind of a more, you know, interactive thing to where you, or not interactive. Yeah, it's more where, straight to the yeah, point. Yeah, there's not, we're not reading a bunch of comments, but we love the comments. Yes. But if you're wanting to know how to make something, it really is a great, mm -hmm. you know, a great place to go and just watch the video. You're not having to listen to comments or, exactly. you know, learn anything about the membership. You're just diving in to make a project. Yep. And it, it, it's It's awesome. the perfect middle ground where it you're is. getting the conversation um, for the video specific. Um, but also getting the quick knowledge. So it's going to be those bits and pieces you'll be able to watch in one sitting really quickly. Um, where the live streams, you get to experience us in a whole different format um, and get to really know every little detail which we love sharing and talking about. So yeah. I think it'll be a great addition. I'm excited to see how it plays out and what you all, what your response is to this new series. But um, what's everyone saying? Everyone is saying again where they're visiting Yay. from. Um, let me see. I have to read this one comment. It oh, is, goodness. it's pitiful. Um, they say Montana is in a deep freeze here, oh. negative 29 degrees oh, and snow. Oh my goodness, guys. You Praying all are for troopers. You all. Yeah, yes. troopers up in there. Well guys, in today's video, we have lots of Valentine's Day inspired projects and they're all from our membership site, makersgonnalearn.com. Now we have hundreds of die cutting files for you to use with your die cutting machine, which we love. Yeah. We love all of the cut files. 
Um, but in today's video, we're talking specifically Valentine's Day. Um, so all the files you'll see here are projects we made from our Valentine's Day collection. And remember guys, we just launched 80 plus fonts on our membership site, makersgonnalearn.com. And if you have your year membership, you're able to get access to those completely free as a bonus. So we have lots of good things here with the membership. You can get your Cricut printable guide, perfect for beginners. Like seriously, we just hit 54,000 YouTube subscribers. What's up, what's up? That's awesome. Yes, thank you guys for all the love. But if you're a beginner watching today, you need your membership, not only for the 700, 650, whatever cut files, 650 different cut files, 100% um, hand lettered. You need your Cricut printable guide, but you also, if you want to go yearly, it's a better financial investment and you're able to get fonts. So we love that. In addition to fonts, we have three courses, three different ones teaching you guys how to master your machine, how to master design space and how to build a business with your die cutting machine. And those like alone, are worth it's the price, worth the of, the price membership. of the membership. Yes, yeah. they're awesome. We have awesome. so many compliments on those courses. We do. And, and they um, teach you all so much. Rachel, can we talk about how many comments we've been getting about the Cricut Printable Guide? Tanner, people want to outright buy this thing. They're not even members no. and they're like, where can we get this? The thing is, you have to be a member, but the best part is you can have any membership tier. So if you want to just commit a month and try out the membership, you can try it out. You get access to the files. You get access to the book. You do not get access to the $150 worth of exclusive video training on the three courses we talked about, and you do not get access to fonts. So that stuff is like huge value. So that's why we highly encourage it. But if you're saying, hey, I wanna just try it out, a uh, monthly membership, you'll get access to the printable guide forever um, and the cut files forever if you only stay a monthly member, say for six months or whatever. Yeah. Um, but what is happening is people are joining for a month, they're getting the printable guide. They're like, ooh, this is great. They're trying out the cut files. They're like, ah, oh, and then they're like, I want more. Um, so that's why we've had a lot of people upgrade. So if you need to upgrade, check out that first link down below, get your year membership, email us, and we'll cancel out that monthly billing cycle. And you need to do that, especially with the fonts yeah. and everything. And we never know what Tanner's got up his sleeve. We he got might a lot. We got to a pour lot. into the <laughs> year members a little more in 2019 than he already has. Yes. So you definitely want to go ahead and upgrade, get the highest here, just mm -hmm. get your year membership. And with the fonts, we have not here today because so this was from last year, but we have already playing some really awesome Valentine's Day projects with their fonts. So that's a big deal. So these are going to be new projects as well as mixing in some of our favorites. And these are some of our absolute favorites from last year. So are there any questions before we jump into talking about the process of all of these different projects? Yeah, there's a couple. Awesome. Karen says, hey, Karen. now that we have access to the fonts, can you teach us how to use them and how to combine different ones? Yes, we have projects specific to that coming up in the next few weeks. So get excited. You're going to love it. And a Chadwick says, what size staples do you use in your favorite gun for reverse canvases? Ooh, um, I have no idea. I think like the quarter inch. I think I really think it's the quarter inch. I'm not sure. We Just, have a bunch of different sizes. We have a lot of different sizes. I think all work well with the reverse canvas. Um, so that's a great question. Just don't yeah. get too thick of ones. Just the average. Right, right. Yeah. That's so, all we got. Awesome. Well, guys, let's jump into it. I want to start on the left and work our way over. And first up is this, speaking of reverse canvas, this is our um beautiful reverse canvas this is one of the first ones i ever was able to create and i love it um what i love about this is this beautiful glitter iron on this is one of our hearts look how it shimmers and i say one of our hearts um this is like hearts on hearts like look at this it's shimmer. so cute i love this file it's absolutely adorable um and it's a reverse canvas so we used our favorite jacko bean stain um, and this is a staple from the actual canvas this isn't a staple i uh, made but um we used iron on i mean this is such a fun project let us know if you all would want a video on a valentine's day reverse canvas because maybe we'll we'll pop one in if you guys want it um so let us know in the comments rachel will be seeing how many the peak interest but yeah. yeah just jacko bean and then let me let me flip it over for the back so if you've never um made one of these this is the back of what mine usually look like i mean you seriously rip apart your canvas um, you iron on, cut and iron on, then you're able to staple. Um, and then of course you stain or paint this separately. I love using stain so you can still see this wood and things like that. So 
here's the Valentine's Day collection on your dashboard. Um, if you don't already, um, you know, if you don't already have it downloaded, you can see the Valentine's Day files are amazing. They are we'll, amazing. We'll be breaking into more of them, but there's so many here on the table too. Um, there's like over 30 in the collection. So you're gonna definitely, definitely love it. Um, next up oh, is this wood plaque. We made this on a live stream last year. And this was one of the first projects we made testing out our iron on for wood. So as you can see here, there were a few fails and all. Well, and this has stood the test of time. Yes, for this a has year. been a year. Um, what, the thing is, when you get these cheaper wood plaques, I mean, look at this price, one ninety nine. Um, this wood plaque was curved. It wasn't actually um, flat like the other ones we use, but it still went on really smooth and well. And this was a multi layered iron on project. Um, so that definitely does tell you something. But this stuff is on. It's sturdy. We love, love, love this project because you are using that more inexpensive wood plaque, but you're getting the iron-on look. So it's kind of, you get to pick and choose your battle with that one. But overall, it went perfect. I just wish this poor little E would have stayed on better. But what can we do? You could honestly just glue that down and you couldn't, you wouldn't do, yeah. Uh -uh. Couldn't even tell. Couldn't even tell. No. <laughs> yeah, so are there any questions about any of these projects? I don't want to go through them too quickly. Uh, yeah. Uh, Tanya says, if you were to stain the wood, like for the reverse mm -hmm. canvas, how long should you wait before applying vinyl to it? So with the wood here, um, it's not really touching the canvas too poorly, or like too much, excuse me. So I would say 45 minutes, like whenever it's dry, whenever you're touching it and it's not coming on your fingers, that's a great um, indicator that you're able to move on to stapling your canvas to the back of the, the frame. And what about if she was using it uh, for the project you have in your hand now? So That's how long question. would she wait before applying vinyl? She I didn't say probably... iron on, she said vinyl. But... Yeah, so this right here is iron on. So you can see it's really like able to adhere to the wood. I love using iron on for wood. Um, but I would let this sit for, gosh, hours. I would heat set it, like try to heat set it with a heat gun, make sure it's really dry. You don't want to have this wet and applying vinyl or iron on, but especially vinyl. Um, you know, this is when you use iron on like we did in this project, the heat really um, sets it and it makes it apply to the wood. So that's why it's such like awesome, like vinyl could not hold as well. Um, so we really recommend being able to do this process because it's really, really awesome. And um, if they were actually using vinyl, normal vinyl, would you still wipe that wood with alcohol? Um, we don't really, wiping, correct me if you're wrong, Rachel, do you think, I don't think alcohol would really help the surface of a no. wood. No, it would what? help like the slick surfaces that you can get like the oils from your fingers like or, some, exactly. or something like that. Yeah. But what I would recommend with this, lightly sand it before you even stain it. Definitely. Just make sure it's nice and smooth. You don't want to have any rough wood trying to apply vinyl to it. That would be horrible. You do not want that. No. I want nice smooth wood. And this would have worked great. I mean, I love the price tag on here, but it's $1.99. Um, you pay for what you get. You pay for what you get. And it was just a little, like, like um, I said it before. Oh, gosh. It was a little... Um, warped. Warped. Yeah. Can't think of warped. Whew. It but was yeah. a little curved, you know, and just that makes curved. it so hard because the easy press is completely flat, mm -hmm. you know, and no matter what size you have, it's just a perfectly flat surface. So it's kind of hard sometimes to get it to Definitely. adhere on that wood, but worth it if you pay good so money good. for like our walnut hollow pieces. Oh, those are never worked. Flawless those are perfect. every time. We've not had any issues ever. No, we have not. I mean, they're amazing. So next up, let's talk about this little set right here. I adore this set right here. This is from the Target Dollar Spot. Um from last year and they'll have more things out if they don't already, I think they already do. Um, but check out, we used iron on on this faux leather stuff. And the tip here is to use a low temp, a lower temperature because this will go on so nicely. We love it. You can put some jewelry in here. This or, is one of those things that vinyl, normal vinyl just couldn't exactly. achieve. You have to do the iron on with this. And at a lower temp, like Tanner said, it helps it adhere perfectly and not, you know, warp your leather or melt it or anything like that. Rachel, with this file, now that we do have the file, but imagine using our new font, our arrow, arrow words, our yes. arrow words, Rachel, putting each of your kids or, you know, grandchildren or your own name on one of these bags that are yeah. two to three dollars. Or your boyfriend's name or girlfriend's name. How yeah. cute. This would be perfect. And it's a great way 
to customize the projects that you're working on. Um, and what I mean by that, this is two or three dollars from the Target Dollar Spot, right? If you use our new Arrow Words font, customize this with whatever saying you would like, your own arrows. You get to pick out both of these and the wordage, um, verbiage. And this is really taking this up from two or three dollars to giving you something custom. And as you can see, this iron on is very sturdy. It's on there perfect. I mean, it's really, I love, 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 love this. It looks awesome. And the iron on on pleather and stuff, it's definitely a technique. I would test out something that you're not sure you're going to want, like something you're not super in love with. Yeah, like buy a tester or something definitely. like that. Definitely. Just because you've got to use that lower temp and a little extra time. Um, and I would recommend putting something in here to kind of um, make sure it doesn't go, the heat doesn't go to the other side. So whether it be a towel, whether it be, um, you know, that small little easy press mat, Rachel, would be oh, perfect. Oh, so cute. That would. Um, yeah. So you just want to be careful about this inside. Um, but yeah, so these are super fun, you know, very interesting and different um, for iron on. If you're thinking of new ideas to use it with, as you can see, this would be able to iron on pretty well. Kind of awkward. You don't want to use like that corner easy press. And again, lighter temperature for a little bit more time. Um, you can be a little bit more, you know, picky choosy with these projects because you do have that theory of it hurting the material. But Rachel, they need to look out for the bubbles. Yes. If you bubbles. start seeing bubbles on your transfer tape, that means the iron-on is adhering to the project and it's not sticking to the transfer tape, which in theory means that it's allowed to stay down. So we love that. Exactly. And make sure we're not going to tell you what temperature or how long that we used on air pleather. You all need to make sure you test it on yours. Every type yeah. of pleather is different. We don't want to set you all up for potentially a craft fail. Correct. So just test on your own, play around with it, and you will get results, you know, with Definitely. your own pleather. So just remember, you're usually heating a t-shirt at 315, 320. So maybe, you know, start at, you can always, the thing is, you can always go more heat, but once you've ruined a project, it's gone. Yeah, So it's you gone. really want to start light, um, you know, not as uh, high of a temperature, maybe 250. Try out 250, see how that does. Give it even pressure. Don't apply too much, give it evenly distributed pressure. Check it after like 10 seconds, like check yeah. it often, you yeah. know? You wanna make sure you're more careful about these, but if you're able to master it, and maybe if this is a big request, we can make a whole video on this. Yeah. If, um, if you guys are interested as well. They're super interested in the reverse canvas for Ooh, Valentine's Day. Okay. So we'll have to put that on the calendar. Okay, we can do that. Um, these projects are definitely those that you'll be able to get a lot of bang for your buck if you're able to master it and it's something that's not as simple as you know cut and apply you know what i mean yeah this is more of getting your own technique down so, and yeah. quintoya wants to know what if you don't have an easy press you're more than welcome to use your iron but let me tell you this project i would not recommend using an iron with the iron is so uneven with the temperature you're going to burn it there's no way in my opinion with what iron I have. Now again, I've only used one or two irons. Maybe you have a really awesome iron, I have no idea. I don't think they make irons to be evenly distributed pressure as an easy press because they don't have to be. Um, but I just don't think this would be the perfect project. Maybe a t-shirt and things like that are still fun to use the iron. But on this project, I'm just gonna recommend not using the iron on, on with a, Iron. iron yeah i mean if you want to try get a couple testers yeah, for sure definitely and go this for isn't it isn't that expensive it's a definitely worth it if you're able to master it with your iron without having to buy anything else two dollars trying two to three dollars on something like this would be perfect so yes. feel free it would be great and lisa says can hey, you lisa. do an htv for dummies video like me well rachel we <laughs> already filmed it i know and we have a few to choose from. So we'll have a few different iron-on videos. We have one already on the channel. Um, what is it called? Um, what is it? How to, it's how to making I, a t-shirt. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, it's how to use iron-on on a t-shirt, mm -hmm. but we're making a video just how to use iron-on for, for beginners. beginners. Yes. It, it's still with a t-shirt, but it breaks down everything than just the specifics. So Rachel hosted it. She's lovely. Yes, um, it was one of my first videos. Yeah, it's going to be awesome. You guys are going to absolutely adore it. Um, so that's a great question. Are there any others? Sandy wants to know, and we'll get here, Sandy, but we'll ask it already. Okay. 
Did you paint the pink canvas? Oh, ooh, this is gonna be a good one, Sandy. Stay tuned, because we're gonna talk all about this project here very soon. We're working left to right, but that's a great question. And the answer is yes and no. It, it's, it's a whole technique we're yes. gonna talk about. Yes, it's a whole stay technique. tuned. <laughs> um, but okay, next up, let's talk pendants right here. I absolutely love our two takes on this project. The pendant banners, they always end up awesome. And we use their Cricut for all of this except all for the pom-poms. Yes. We now, just glue the pom-poms. You, you can cut these pendants with felt. You use your 12 by 24 mat, felt in your rotary blade, make the pendant. You can make them two sizes. You can design it all in design space. All you do, cut it. You take your rope, your little rope and your little um skewer sticks that you get at the craft store paint dowels it. yes the dowels thank you rachel skewer sticks hmm. those um, would work too <laughs> little thin but yeah our dowels we you can use jute for one look you can also use the nautical rope all found at the craft store pom-poms yeah. i mean you can make this project your own very easily and iron on on felt man it's perfect here let's let's show them you can show them this um I'm really doing you guys like as much love as possible because I hate touching um, felt. It's one of my biggest things. I just, I get cold it's chills. Funny. Look, he's already put it down. He's I, like, I already, oh, I get real bad cold chills touching felt. I have no idea why. But we really love that you're able to get this really awesome look with the felt. It, it adheres so well to the felt. Really well with the felt. And it gives you kind of like a, like, you know, new texture look, you know, when you're hanging it. I mean, these will be perfect in your home. And they're so easy and inexpensive. I mean, felt is ridiculously low. Everything here, you may already have a majority. You would get the, the little dowel. We used hot glue to glue the, the pendant on. I mean, it's such a fun, fun project. Yes, and you probably have like all of this in your craft space anyways. Yeah. So this is a great project to, you know, just put up in your home for Valentine's Day. And it's one of those very small ones that you can like roll this up and put it in oh, yeah. storage for next year. Definitely. It's perfect. And the thing is, guys, like we have some of these that are like really like multiple steps. Like this are multiple steps. You know, these are multiple steps. This is a technique more. So the reverse canvas is fun. But then you can also do simple, quick and easy like these two, which I love. Look at this. So you're able to quickly take a glass. I'm trying to oh, here we go. trying to get this here. We're using our same file as we used on the reverse canvas. Cut it out a little smaller. I mean, look at that detail. It's on... so cute. But think about your little pink drink in there or whatever. Oh, and just having that gold party. pop at your little Valentine's Day party. Yes. So cute. Oh my gosh. I love, love, love this. And then this one right here is also equally as adorable. Now remember, our cut files are 100% hand lettered. So these are amazing. We work with some of the best artists ever. I love, 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 um, you know, our hand lettering artists. And guys, if you have not yet already got your membership, maybe you're thinking about getting a membership, we would love to welcome you um, to the community and be able to share with you all the fun. So these are our hand-lettered images. You're able to get over 700 digital cut files at our membership, makersgonnalearn.com, where if you click that first link down below, you're able to get a membership today. So every single month, we give a monthly collection of digital cut files, free commercial license. Um, you get a member only Facebook group access, monthly live streams, exclusive projects. There's no ads and special pricing for current and future courses. So we love, love, love that. And Tanner, I just want to make you aware. Yes. We ha we're having, I've never seen this stream button be oh red. Oh my gosh. Uh, but it looks like everything's going okay. You all let it's us know. It's now yellow. Okay. Let us know if you see anything. It's okay, now it's green. green. Okay. I'm sorry to I disrupt. I just wanted to this is crazy. make you aware in case anything happens. I don't know. But anywho, here's our three different membership tiers. As you can see, our year membership is the best value, um, which we love. And being a year member gets you access to our fonts, which are hundreds of dollars of value when you have 80 plus fonts. Then you get the three courses for completely free when it comes to learning how to use your Cricut, how to use design space and build a business with your die cutting machine. So if you're ready to say yes to being more crafty, getting inspired to use your die cutting machine, be sure to check out that first link down below because you're gonna get access to make all of these projects, get awesome files, 
and we would love to have that they can get their membership you know there's some if not already got one and you want to join like we say these are all handmade with the reverse canvases and the you know the drilling and these it's things it's awesome so we seriously are very beginner friendly we are buffering uh oh uh, oh hold on you want me to check the wi-fi no see us now oh no oh, oh no. no not good not good you're back for a second i can say oh no yeah we go Buffering, hi friends, hi friends, let's see what happens. Okay. Okay, oh, okay. hang on. Oh, you're gone now. I think oh I'm... no. Look, you're just gone. Oh no. Oh, we're yellow. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, everybody oh, wanted to know about her. Oh no. Where did Tanner go? Where did Tanner go? Tanner, you just weird. Oh no. <laughs> oh, they don't even see us now. <laughs> Come back. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. This is the worst thing that's happened during our live stream. Um. I don't know what to do. Okay, hang on. Hi. Nope. Hi. Nope. Oh no. I know. Are you a ghost? No. Oh. I posted oh. it on your behalf. Thank you, thank you. You're welcome. And then! Joseph, come here. I'm mocked up so it could come back in here. It's Joseph, need you. Oh no, I, now it's, oh, oh. Joseph, oh. we need It keeps you. going different colors. The invisible Tanner, a superpower. <laughs> My students are looking at me. Reboot and do a part two. This is the, I just did a speed test. This is Fibernet. This is Fibernet. <gasps> Hannah says quit like yelling at Joseph. Can they hear us? I think they can hear us. Well, I, I think it comes and goes. Oh no. I think they can hear us though, Tanner. No, they hear us for a split second. Oh, I thought they hear us. I love that we haven't lost our viewership. No, nope, they, they stayed so at 153 for like ever. Hey guys, we're having to... Wow. Okay, wait, 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 oh, hey. wait, wait, go back, Tanner. Oh, hey. Go back, go back, hey, Tanner. Guys. We're not buffering. <laughs> Tanner, are you back? Are we buffering? Let's see. Let's Tanner. See. Are you back? I'm so Where are sad. you at, Tanner? Guys, this is the first issue we've had. Tanner, Tanner. What's everyone saying in the comments? Yes, we can hear you. We can hear you. This is... <gasps> wait, wait, wait. We're back! Hey, hey what's everybody! Up? What's up? We... Okay. Story time. No, hang on. No. We have not lost a single viewer. Just say thank Hello. you. Hello! We thank love you. you all. We love every one of you. Joseph, we're back! It worked! <laughs> What'd you do, Joe? Switched our Wi-Fi for... <laughs> Thanks, okay, Carter. Joseph, man, this is the best investment. Saving <laughs> us every day. We did not lose many viewers. No. Nope. They're the best. You all are amazing. Sorry, guys. Loyal, faithful. Wow. This is great. Well, anyway, guys, back to what we're saying. Wow. I'm still just blown away. Rachel, can you hey. believe <laughs> can you believe we have to have two internet providers? Yes, I can. <sighs> Our local internet provider has not been doing their job. So Tanner had to invest in a second one for this exact reason. Yeah, during the summit last year, our internet actually went down. Thankfully, not during the summit day, but that afternoon after but day Poor Tanner one, had to scramble. He ended up going location. to Joseph's house. Yeah, so now we have two internet providers. So literally, Joseph just went and unplugged one internet provider and plugged our second one in. Tanner, so, why don't hello. we just ditch the first one? I know. For the for everyone. Well, anyway, anyways. Guys, anyway, back to what we're talking about. I don't know where I was at. I just had this open. So we were talking about the different membership tiers. How many people? Well, now that all the comments about buffering has went away, how many people have been enjoying their year membership? If any newbies are out there, um, the year membership we love because you're able to get the courses, the fonts, the die cutting files the printable God, which we absolutely adore. And guys, you get all this to say, it's a cheaper price than our monthly. And the reason why we pour into this year membership tier is because you pour into us saying, yes, I wanna be here for a year. Um, you can cancel at any time, which is awesome. But you won't ever want to. You will never want to. Nope. Um, but you don't have to budget in this with your monthly bills or expenses. Every membership I'm a part of, I do yearly because everyone gives the financial incentive. And on top of that, we're giving you hundreds of dollars of bonuses. So we love that. And guys, I just want to say again, thank you so much for bearing with us. So if you want to join, click that first link down below. 
So what's everyone saying? You all, everyone I see saying, hearts. Oh, you, all of this is comic relief. They're all loving it, okay? They love what happens. They love it on their Monday. Anyway, <laughs> some more about it's the membership. Monday. Yes. <laughs> about the membership, Hannah wanted to mention the free commercial license. And uh, yes, we love it. And yes. people are saying, love my yearly membership. Have belonged since the beginning, and it's a great value. Who commented that? Mary Stevens. I love you, Mary. Stephens. Thank you, thank you, thank you. She's so sweet. Chadwick says you can make anything with the fonts. You can. Everyone loves it. Everyone is saying, oh, okay, Tanner, we have people Ooh. saying, how do I become a member? That's a great question. So I'll walk you through the process real quick, and we'll finish talking about these great projects because the ones we haven't talked about yet are some of the best. And so let's just click right here. You can see here that we have the video. So what you'll want to do... Um, Here's what we're going to do. We're going to open this right here. <gasps> Eileen says, we'll always be a yearly member. The value is un um, uh, unbelievable. So Aww. you're so sweet. So all you need to do if you want to become a member today is click this first link in the description. Click open. And you can do the same thing on your desktop. Um, and you're going to be able to go right down here. If you know you want to be a year member, just press the blue button. It's going to give you our best value, which is our year membership. You can read about it, see what you get. And then there's the three different tiers. So right here. So super, super awesome. How easy is that? And this is PayPal. So you click on this um, and you can choose two options. You can pay with credit or debit card by pressing the gray button to your left. Or if you already have a PayPal account, just click the yellow button to your right. It's super easy. We made it as easy as possible. And our customer service works Monday through Friday. 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. Eastern. If there's anything you need help with, we're here to serve you guys with um, tips and tricks for your machine. Uh, the Facebook group is a great place. We have hundreds of cut files. We have Disney inspired files. Um, every holiday that you can think of, that's the big ones. So Easter, um, Christmas, Thanksgiving, um, fall, like Halloween. We have the Valentine's Day. I mean, there's so many and we're just growing every single month. So once you get a membership, you're not just getting access to what we've already made, which is a huge value. You get access to every other collection as we come out with new ones. So there's, you say, wow, there's 700 cut files now, but we're adding 30 to 50 every single month with a new collection. By the end of the year, we're going to be at over 1,500. And if you're, um, you remember, that's 1,500 that you have you know, or not 15, but that's, oh, you know, a whole Hundreds. year's worth yeah. that you have already paid for, already going to enjoy, mm -hmm. and you don't even know what all is coming in the Rachel year. Rachel Tanner just pops sneak. stuff out, okay? Like, like this God, we didn't yes. tell people we were making it. No. The response has been so wonderful that we're honestly working on more gods like this because if this gives you guys value and helps your crafting, that's what we're here to do. And so, Tanner. That's what we love. First of all, we have a comment that says, this show has been the highlight of my day. Love it. <laughs> Love you. Um, <laughs> we have a comment, are all the files included in the membership? Yes. So here's what we mean by that. Whether you're a monthly, six month, or yearly member, you get access to all the digital cut files. If you're uh, just a monthly member, you do not get the $150 worth of bonus training courses, which is huge. You want that or access to the font dashboard where we have over 80 fonts. So you're able to customize projects like this and so much more. The fonts are such a great value. We don't even know how to price the value on the fonts, to be honest. It's hundreds of dollars of value if you were trying to buy commercial licenses to all of these fonts somewhere else, honest. Um, so yeah, so for less than, you know, uh, right, it's a huge value what you're getting with something with the year membership valued at like five or 600 bucks, a year membership is like one third the price of that. So huge savings with the year membership. And Tanner, how hey. can monthly or six monthly members upgrade? Of course. So you can click the first link, get your year membership, then send us an email saying, hey, I'm a monthly subscriber. I uh, just switched to yearly. Please um, send me how I can cancel out that monthly billing cycle and we will give you the link to how to do that it's really quick and simple um and we can even do it for you if you're not able to do it on your own but we like giving you guys the independence to know for a fact that there's no more monthly billings and vanessa says it's my year is almost up how do i renew it's automatically going to renew vanessa is that was that her name mm -hmm. uh yeah so it's automatically go renew 
so you don't have to worry about it, but just make sure your PayPal account is up to date with your latest credit card information um, or whatever payment you chose, bank, PayPal balance, either way, um, that will just automatically come out. And then um, if for some reason you're, you got a new card, um, you want to make sure that's updated because you will lose access to the membership site if that fails. So I hope that helps answer your question. And Tanya has hey, a good Tanya. question. Is it Tanya from the live stream the other day? Yeah. <gasps> hey. She's still here. <laughs> she says, I keep hearing Rachel mention not knowing what's up Tanner sleeve for yearly members. I want a hint. Well, <laughs> Tanya, here's the thing. We don't have any hints because sometimes Tanner comes to the team and he's like, guys, this is fonts. Or he's like, listen, we're going to give away a Starbucks gift card. Or, hey, we're we going to treat the members and we're just going to make this guides. awesome guide. And we're awesome not even going to tell them about it. We're just going to say, hey, it's there. We just drop stuff. And if we, you're a yearly member, that is the best chance of getting in on what all Tanner has up his sleeves. Which, exactly honestly, true. there's always stuff cranking in that brain of his. <laughs> so you just want the best value Rachel anyways. Me up. I just got to, I mean, <laughs> he comes to us, oh, listen, guys, he comes to us all the time and he's just like, guys fonts and we're all kind of like that's all he drops and we're just like okay tanner fonts how are and we, we figure it out and we figure it out but he just comes to us because he just wants to pour into you guys and i am the middle it's man awesome i'm the middleman guys here's all everyone that isn't is a member and then here's the team i'm the middleman listening just letting people know what we, we need yes what we need exactly. we needed fonts we needed the cut files there's a member's choice cut file collection with over a hundred cut files coming out, but and it's called the member's choice collection because it's listening to everything you all have asked for. We've got things for Mardi Gras, we've got things for nurses, we've got things for cat lovers, dog lovers, you know, all these different things that are specific. And we decided to make a member's choice collection. With so, over how many again, Tanner? Over a hundred. A hundred cut files. So it's things like that where we're able to really take what you guys want and bring it to life. You know, you all wanted print and cut files. We've brought you tons of print and cut files um, and things like that. So we really do try to listen um, as much as possible and be able to make some really amazing products uh, from our digital cut file collections to our fonts, to our printable guides that people are still asking me to purchase these individually. I know. Member only. You have to be a member. We love our members. We love. And love, Kimberly love members. is a member. Hey, She's Kimberly. a yearly member. So Woo whoop whoop for you. <laughs> she says, "How do we get notified of all these new goodies? Do we get to check our dashboard?" Yeah, um, you can always check your dashboard. Be sure to check the email that you created your account with, because we send out newsletters. If you're a member, you have a member only newsletter that lets you know when the new cut file collections come out every. 12th to the 15th of the month those collections are going up um, and it's they're wonderful so be sure to get on that if you have never received any emails from us maybe reach out and we'll make sure you're on that list and tanner we have so many questions Ooh. asking for a hint for n this month's collection don't do it tanner I'm i'll not. just tell them they're gonna ask it's i'm gonna let you know it's the 12th of the month it's not too far away no it's not too i far specifically away. said tanner i it's want eight this days away i want this to come out on the 12th so. Rachel told me, and I made that happen. Yes. So the 12th of the month is wonderful. Rachel, what are you taking pictures of? Uh, let me tell you. Tell me. I, I'm going to tell you this This call me. I had to take a picture of it because I'm keeping it forever. Oh, no. Now, the name is... Uh, Hold on. Is it someone inviting us to their wedding again? No, no. It's way better. <laughs> NYSY97 says, Tanner drops craft surprises like, a be like Beyonce drops albums. <laughs> <laughs> and, I, and I just had to keep it. That's my favorite. I had you're, to keep You're it. the winner of the day. Tanner okay. drops craft surprises like Beyonce drops albums. I'm all for it. We love you. That's the best. We love you. I love it. Love okay. It. Are there any questions before we talk about our beautiful sign over here? Let me see. Okay. If you use a credit card when you sign up, how can you change that to a different card before your membership renews? That's a great question. So PayPal will give you the login information to go back and change that on your payment side. So what we love about our payment processing with PayPal is that we do not have your credit card information, no debit card information. People email us saying, hey, can we call in and update our credit card information? We don't store that. We use PayPal because they have such high security, things I would never be able to do. Um, so they handle all that for you and us. So it's a great way where you're taken care of and you have that security on PayPal's end. And then we are able to focus in on making awesome products. 
So yeah, you'll I'm be able ready, to get all that. I'm ready to hear about more Valentine's Day okay, projects. Okay, more Valentine's Day projects for all of you that are so awesome and faithful for sticking with us. Um, I really appreciate it. Here is some of our beautiful signs. Now we make a lot of different ones of these. Um, I believe this was a member only live stream. So we teach you exactly how to make this in a member only live stream. So if you're an existing member and you want to see this made complete start to finish, it is not a, um, it's not a YouTube video. This is in our Facebook videos. So it's just like this one over here, which we love, but notice it has white stain. People were like, Tanner, we need to give a spin to it. And I thought, why not? do this. So I'm going to teach you just really quickly what we did, but this is another reason why you need a membership to see the whole thing created in a member only live stream. Um, you, you need the membership to the Facebook group. So you need the membership for a thousand reasons, of but course. definitely the Facebook group is way of up course. there. And we have the exclusive live streams over there, but, um, this was made with permanent vinyl, which we love. You've got to use permanent on the, these because we didn't on that one. And it's, I mean, it's actually staying pretty well. This one's staying really well. There's some projects that were like, oh, we needed the permanent, but that one doing really good. Anyway, we teach you how to build these signs, which are phenomenal. And there's a master class on building signs at the summit. So you can get this, but if you want even more about sign making and things like that, um, you want to go to the summit. So anyway, the, how you get this pink, Sandy was asking, did we paint it? We did not paint it. Here's what I do, Sandy. You take your white stain, which we talk about. We love our white, um, our white wash stain from Minwax. You take it in a solo cup. You add a little drop or two of the acrylic paint of your choice. You mix that together, and then you apply it as stain. And it's this like is a beautiful able. colored stain. You can create whatever color you want. So if you don't have the money to buy 20 colors of stain, heck, not even about money, the space for those big bottles of stain, get you your white stain. You're able to mix your favorite colors, the colors that you're not really able to get in stain, for example, pink, um, and be able to create this look. It's a great technique, we love it, um, and it's perfect for the types of projects that you wanna be able to do when it's just a sign, quick mix. It's a really great project process that I just tested out and the reason why I did not use paint, this is a great time to talk about that. If you're using paint on this wood back here, when you apply the transfer tape and the iron, the vinyl, Rachel, that paint, she comes up. She could come up. She comes up. It is not as secure. When you use stain, you're able to, it doesn't take away anything from the wood. So and I have that. to say PSA. 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 Give us the PSA, okay. Rachel. I don't care what project you're using. If you're doing anything with spray paint, do not use vinyl at all. Just just don't even use spray paint. Anything Rachel, with spray you, paint with your vinyl. do you have a craft bill you would like to share? Tanner. Every, every time I've tried to spray paint something and then add vinyl, it's always been a craft fail. I've, like with the transfer tape, just something about spray paint with how thin of a layer it is, it just chips right up with it. Do you not feel the same way? I do feel the same way. I know, and it's it's rough. It depends on the surface. I, I haven't really used it too, I haven't used spray paint too much on wood just because I prefer the look of acrylic paint and things like that oh, and chalk same, paint on same. wood. But if you're using glass and spray paint, just be warned, peeps. Yeah, be careful. Be, be careful. careful. Uh, but yeah, so we love this sign. So be sure to check that one out in the membership group, like we said. Um, if you haven't already, we used our, our air nailer, which we love. You can kind of see here um, these little bitty these little bitty nails, which I'm obsessed with. You can for... barely even see them. Exactly. That's what I love. It's such low profile. Like you can't even tell. Look um, how tiny. Yeah. So super, super fun. Great project for you guys to tackle for this um, Valentine's Day. But you can still see that wood grain. Mm -hmm, oh, it's beautiful, mm -hmm. Tanner. We love making these songs. And they're great for beginners, honestly. Um, it's something that you're able to be like, ooh, I literally took pieces of wood and built my very own sign, which was wonderful. So we love, love, love that. Now, Tanner, mm -hmm. Tracy says, hey, Tracy. do you run membership deals only in December? We have a few throughout the year. Um, if you want to get access today, obviously full price, and we fully think that the full price is worth it. Like the most we ever run out of sale is for 20%. And honestly, waiting out for one of those I don't think it's worth the 20% to be Because honest. let's just say it, okay? Tanner hates 
giving sales. I, I he don't. likes it for the people, but he really does not love giving sales because he, it the team, and I think that most of the members would say full price is already still a great deal for you're what you're getting. You're still getting a great deal, but you know, 20%, you get to start crafting today rather than having to wait um, and things like that. And honestly, the 20, like being able, like full price, you're still going to get an amazing deal. You're going to get your value out of it. Um, so that's, that's my two cents, but I know how much craft stores have conditioned crafters to think you have to have a sale to buy anything. Um, at least that's what like Michaels and Hobby Lobby teaches you. We run off the same mentality. So I understand, um, that perspective. So yeah, that's my two cents on sales, um, from a business standpoint and my, my consumer standpoint. And we're already getting, um, comments oh. pouring in saying oh. that it's a great full price <laughs> deal. It's still worth every penny. Aww. So thank you all guys. Thank you guys for that. Yeah. And what do we mean by full price deal? Like, look at this, what you're able to see here, this is our different tiers. You know, this is full price. Like this is $15.99 a year, um, build annually. So the three months free is instead of paying $19.99 a month times 12, you're only paying $15.99 a month times 12. That's your financial incentive here. We highly recommend that year membership because um, you're already getting that savings with that year versus monthly. Monthly is pretty expensive. I'm not it going, is. It I'm not is. Going, I mean, $20 is definitely a few Starbucks trips. The sad but, part is yeah. we can only say a few. Right, right. <laughs> But um, especially with the membership, Hannah D comments, um, a couple comments this time, but she says it's worth full price for the commercial license alone. And I don't think true. we talk enough about we the commercial don't. license. So if Hannah is amazing for bringing this up because I always get like sidetracked. So thank you, Hannah. Um, but with the commercial license, she's 100% correct. You are able to use our cut files for your own profit. What we mean by that, you're able to use our artwork and sell your own artwork frames. Yeah. What I'm super excited for at the summit class is we're teaching you how to build these, how to make these. These can sell for upwards 60, 80. Larger ones can sell for over a hundred dollars. And not just those. Tanner could sell the whole table. Like he could, he could, could sell everything on easily, the table. Okay. Just easily. slap prices on it and sell it. So yeah. not only are you paying for the membership, but you, I mean, it pays for itself, mm -hmm. especially if you use your free commercial license, exactly. whether you're selling at your church or through an Etsy site or, you know, a Facebook marketplace, yeah, yard sales, so many. whatever. But this, Ooh. all this stuff is just so popular. Exactly. Who doesn't want to be able to have custom hand letter pieces? They're able to sell. You can <gasps> customize these with our Damn. fonts. If you have the year membership yes. and remember the commercial license is only applicable if you have an active membership, if you become inactive and you don't have a membership currently, that commercial license is only for active memberships. I like to point that out. That's um, another reason why you just need to get the yearly. So you know you have the have commercial license it. for a whole year. You could sell probably six of these frames, maybe even less. I'm trying to be conservative, conservative um, and pay for your membership. You know, you could make um, a, less than a dozen t-shirts and pay for your membership. Things like that where you're able to use this. We curate amazing collections. Courtney is our creative director for the collections and she curates such amazing um, inspiration for our artists. We love it. I mean, it's, it's so awesome. Much. It's, it's, awesome. it's awesome. We love it. And the Valentine's Day projects are some of my favorites. So yeah, are there any questions? Have we went over all the projects? Are there any project related questions? Let us know. Membership questions, anything you've got, let us know. We don't have any project questions. Okay. Are there any in general questions? Everyone's saying um, it's still super worth the membership. Oh, thank Lisa you guys. says, do you have to have the license to sell the crafts? And if so, how and where? So it's tell her about like what the license yeah, is. Yeah. So we have the, it's a it's just the commercial license saying that we're not going to sue you for using our artwork to make a profit. There's some people that needed to print out verbiage and things like that um, for like having on hand at their shop or something. We can email you that, but as long as you have an active membership, um, and if we see you selling something like this on Facebook Marketplace, we will not like come after you with like a cease and desist or like anything like yeah, that. Yeah, just as um, long as you have active membership, don't even worry about your yeah, you're the able license, to just you know. be able to list your finished projects on Etsy. Yeah. You're not just for clarification. You don't have rights to resell the artwork as files. So you can't take our 700 cut files and then try to post them on Etsy as individual files. We will come at you with a cease and desist letter. Um, you have, <laughs> Frankly. You have the access to use the projects, use the files to make projects 
and then sell them. That's the commercial license rather than a resale license. So just like to clarify that if there's any um, specifics that people are curious about. But no, we don't have any more questions. Awesome. Everybody's given a lot of love. Yay. You all are amazing. Sherry says, hi from me all the way in the UK. Hey, from the UK. Hello, yeah, we love, love that we have friends from every, we you know, love everywhere. It. You all are amazing. So be sure to, you know, let us know if there's anything we can do for you um, in the comments. Any questions real quick before we end today's show. Be, um, come back tomorrow. Rachel, are we making a Valentine's Day project tomorrow? What? Why don't we just tell them to wait and find out? <gasps> Wait and find out. Rachel's not giving you guys nothing. No. Oh my gosh. C can you at least tell me if we're making a Valentine's Day project? Yeah, I'll tell you. Okay. I'll well, tell you. I I'm pretty sure it's a Valentine's Day project, guys, if Rachel won't share. If not, I'm making her make it a Valentine's Day project. It, yes, it's a Valentine's Yay! Day project. We gotta give them something. I know. So come back tomorrow for a Valentine's Day project. You and guys... many more through the weeks oh, leading so up to Valentine's many. Day. We have a ton that you all will love to make. It's gonna be really good. We just wanted to make this video to get you inspired. Um, if you have any questions on the individual projects, we can send you links to those. Um, it's gonna be a lot, a lot of fun. So be sure to get your membership. The first link down below, remember that guys, um, to hurry over there and grab that. So thank you, thank you, thank you for hanging out with us and getting inspired for Valentine's Day. We cannot wait to share many more ideas with you for the next couple of weeks. So get excited and I hope you all have a great day. Any last questions popping in? Let's see. Oh, Lisa says what time? Ooh, so we don't have a specific time. We usually pop in anywhere from like 12 p.m. Eastern to like 2 p.m. Eastern is usually like our time that we like to go live. So stay tuned, turn your notification bell on so you get notified via that email and push notification to your phone. So that's awesome. But thank you, thank you, thank you guys. I hope you all have a fantastic day and we'll see you guys tomorrow. All right, bye.